All right, let's go to our third symbol. All right, so the next symbol is Besi Saka. Besi Saka. It's a symbol of affluence, of abundance. It's an actual depiction of a bunch of kola nuts. And kola nuts were super significant, and they still are to the Ghanaian economy. And so this um, symbol represented affluence, power, abundance, plenty. And then when you think of the kola nuts together, it, um, or a bunch of kola nuts, it represents togetherness and unity. We'll get more into that when it comes to the journaling portion, but to draw this, restart the video. So we'll start with a circle at the center. And then give yourself a little space between your circle and the next line that you draw, which will be a little straight line, just a few, an inch or so. And then draw a pair to that line right at the bottom. So two parallel lines. And then we'll connect those with the half circle. And we need four of those. So we'll come down here and draw our two parallel lines on our half circle. And go all the way around. And then around these, I have to draw our colon nuts. So starting from the tip of your first parallel line, and do a half oval shape around that. Do that four times. So from edge to edge, do half oval shapes. Oval shape. And then last half of the oval shape. And then around that. I'm spelling my grandmother's name. <laughs> so we're gonna spell it right. Only happy little mistakes, as Bob Ross would say. <laughs> okay. So a lot of space to color in on this one, if you want to. If you if not, here's some journaling ideas for you. Or you can do both. It doesn't have to be either or. <laughs> If there's any thoughts that come up for you around abundance, what does that mean for you? 
aside from financial abundance, what are some other ways that you like to cultivate abundance in your life? It can be abundance of love with your friends and family and self. Maybe you have an abundance of food and water and everything that you need in that regard. Another thought to journal, what does togetherness and unity mean for you? Has that definition changed over the past 18 months? How has it stayed the same? It's a little bit longer, about 30 seconds or more on this one, and then we'll get to our final two drawings. <laughs> 